what's going on everybody welcome back to the channel today got another little short video on an upgrade to the uh the xj um today we're gonna get rid of this well inside the jeep you'll see in a minute there's a cigarette lighter then there's a power outlet um i don't use a cigarette out, uh, cigarette outlet i don't smoke i don't need a cigarette outlet um, the only thing I use it for is like charging my phone or something like that. And um, that's really kind of just a pain in the butt because they always pop out or break or can't find one or any of that. So we will take that out and we're going to install a um, little USC, USB plug port, whatever you want to call them. I bought this one off Amazon. I'll leave the link to it in the description. And this one is... Um, Got two plugs, got a little voltage um, display in the center of it, and uh, should be fairly easy to put in. And um, let's get set up inside the Jeep here and uh, get started. All right, it might be kind of hard to see because uh, kind of I ain't got no place really to put the camera, so we'll try this and. See how it works out, I guess. So the first thing we got to do is remove the bezel and the actual AC. I'm not sorry, the switch panel there. So first of all, we'll remove this bezel here. Basically, you just grab at the bottom and pull out. Set that over in the floor. Set that up there out the way. Now we could uh, take the um, actual switch out. You got three Phillips head screws. Now with the screws out, we just have to uh, remove the connections. All right. Now what we got to do is remove this and I see videos I've seen videos where people kind of just pinch this and crush it and then get it out that way and then they break off some plastic pieces in there um, I don't really want to do that just in case I may have to use it again for something probably won't but we'll see so you got two little clips right here I'm gonna push up on them a little bit but this is how I do it anyway it's probably a better or easier way but so I just bend those up out the way on both sides. And on the inside, you can't see them, but they're a little like dimple right there on that side and one on this side. I just like to take and find something and push on that a little bit on both sides. And then usually I can find something like a little hammer, a little screwdriver, a pair of pliers. And just kind of smack this kind of hard and it, it comes right on out. Just like that. Now, I'll probably never use it again for anything. But if I do, I have it. It ain't all broke up. Now, that hole is definitely smaller than this. So we got to... Either grind it out, file it out, sand it out, something. So I got a file. I'm going to file it out and I'm going to get it filed down to size and uh, I'll be right back. Alright. So I ended up having to break some plastic off the back. 
and filed this hole out right there. Now we should be able to take our USB here, unscrew the back. At first I was going to take a little rubber boot off, but I kind of like it only to keep dirt out of there. So, it should slide right through the hole. Maybe. Yep. Slides right on up in there. And then the only other thing you got to do is put the little lock nut on the back. Get it hand tight. And make sure it's facing the direction that you want it to face. I want mine straight up and down. And that's that part of it. Now, the next step is cut the plug off. Strip the wires back. Maybe two spade connectors. Crimp them on if you can get to it. For some reason, I'm struggling. All right. Now, black goes to negative, red goes to hot. Let's see if we got power to it. Find the key. Now reassemble everything. All right, everything snapped back in place. Good to go. All right, thanks for watching. Um, please remember to like, subscribe, share, comment. Let me know how the channel's doing. Um, if there's anything y'all like to see, or if I'm doing something wrong, or if you just want to make a, just leave a comment. Um, also, click the notification bell uh, so you can get updated when I release new videos. Um, let me know, I guess, if uh, you have any ideas or something, uh, if I can improve the channel. And uh, thanks to everybody who's watched it and subscribed. And help the channel grow um, I like to get a, a few hundred more subscribers really I'm at like between 350 and 400 I think now um, again I hope this video helps somebody um, I'll leave the part number or the yeah I guess the part number to the USB port I use from Amazon in the description and uh, I'll see you in the next one thanks again